Nyam, 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 nyam. Yeah, so it does it. It does it about the same kind of times as GT3 does the 26. full Celsius, VLN. Laps. Okay, police, be ready. Watch for the lights. Go. Twenty more laps this time by. Twenty more laps this time by. Oh god, here we go. We survived. He didn't. Yeah, you're gonna win it right there, people. Okay, chat has a been a, put on a higher volume. Oof. Well, you just keep going up from the speed. And you can clearly see everyone's piled up. Got half the field, so I think they can win it from midfield on lap one. Hey, Mikey P. That was loud, yep. Yeah. Well, the best bank will win on the race. My greetings back. How's it going, Mikey? We're trying to get to. 2k we need 12 i ratings so we're on course right now Three. The leader has just done a 115.20. 2k modded the house, we hope. 1988 right now. In 18 laps or so, we might be looking at a different situation. So far, so good, yeah. Hup, hup. And to answer the question you didn't ask, Alan. Oh, he's dead behind. And that's not the question you were asking. Um, yeah, everything feels better now. I think it was that the rig had got a bit compressed. I just stretched it out a little bit. It's um, a fold away one for space purposes. So it got a bit compressed and that's why everything felt a bit weirdly off. Yeah, Oren Park. Always fun. The guy in front was just uh, <laughs> 115.48. Oops. I don't know if I actually hit the wall there, but it felt like I did. Oh. Timothy Bentley. Speaking of high speed. Oh, Carly getting a bit loose there. Ray Peasley having a good race as well up front there. 
That was um, totally intentional. Just trying to freak him out, you know, get him a bit disturbed by almost dying. You know, that'll show him. <laughs> yep. Everyone to stop what they're doing and get down and boogie to the 2K tunes. That's your quickest lap in this session. Sector two is 0.7 off the pace. Didn't know how much Carly was going to check up there. That could have gone in a different direction. I heard on the side of caution. But yeah, I mentioned Ray because maybe two years ago or so, Ray was one of those guys, you know, the, the lapped traffic that would kill the leader. So he's come on a long way since those crazy days. Which is great to see. I normally hot lap a bit faster than him, but uh, we're Second basically of a pace in a race. Place. This is awkward. Uh, there's a lot better places to let us go than that. <laughs> Fortunately, we were both impacted, so, you know, whatever. Yeah, there is plenty of space behind. So we are... We're safe in that regard. As long as Timothy gives us space and doesn't um, draft right into us here, we should be we should be that good. Lap time was 115.51. Sector one is 0.5 off the pace. I'll be going a bit faster, but Carly is slow into the first corners. P6. And that's a really difficult place to pass somebody without risking it all, you know? Oh, 
Uh-oh. Ivan, you're jumping all over the place. Australians love this track, as you might imagine why. Time was at 114.9. Yeah, not close enough. Yeah, it's a uh, it's good for people with technical skills, isn't it? This one, and you've got technical skills, Alan. Memes aside. Okay. Double pass. That was a send that we could be proud of. Let's try and run away. Fucking sent. Sorry. That's half distance. The fuel's okay. B3. The gun is sent. 4.6 seconds. <laughs> Taylor 
Oh, right. Well, I thought we've got a nice gap. I'm assuming we don't bugger that up. For a podium. Tremendous. <laughs> we take these all the way home, we really do. Probably not going to catch Ray at this rate, but um, don't be silly there, Graham. I think we can be happy with a P3 in the circumstances. Circumstances being a mediocre qualifying session. Sorry, Graham. You've just done a 114.40. That's your best lap in this session. So, how are you anyway, Mikey? I hope your Monday has been swell. Same with you, Colin. I hope everything is going according to your standards of goodness. This isn't, in fairness, the easiest track to banter while driving. <laughs> What races are we all doing next week, by the way? Anything anything good on next week? It's Imola in Skippies, so meh. Well, that's good to know. The guy in front has just done a 114.24. You've just done a Reasonable levels of goodness. Can I offer you a builder's tea to go with your reasonable levels of goodness? in the radical there we go that sounds like it's going to be a heck of a lot of fun vos at phillip island did you do the um samsoid 24 at phillip island are you well practiced there that lap time was two sugars okay give me a sec yellow flag you got it break out on the right good brother Thought something happened to Ray for a second there, but it's Juan. The gap ahead is now 5.7 seconds. At Phillip Island, yeah, it's it's kind of nightmare fuel. With all the blind or semi-blind corners, they weird elevation changes. 
some very samey corners that are actually quite different and of course a weird camber Whoa. and uh, slippiness does not help I can't say I have either wanted to or attempted to drive wait I have driven the Ferrari there because I was going to do the Sampsoy 24 and I was practicing the Ferrari there yeah I didn't drive any other cars so I don't know how it stacks up but I enjoyed it I mean as much as I can enjoy driving a GT3 which isn't much oh Bertrand Gaspard behind got to be careful of that situation developing No, I gather that's probably the case. Mid-engined and all that, yeah. I mean, I certainly wouldn't want to take a Porsche around there either, to be fair. Time is a 114.10. What are you doing, man? Well, that was a 115.12. Uh, so the three is 0.6 off the face. Mate, if the car's in the front, I'll have to fly the line, mate. It's easy for you to say. The funny thing about racing is to be in front, you actually have to be in front. <laughs> yeah, so we've got the game face on right now. Because it is on. That was my bank holiday. I spent a lot of it driving this track over and over again. And it was nice. Nice and chill other than that. I, uh, I said before you weren't here we had a moment with our cat and she put her foot in one of my high heel boots it's not a tall boot so her entire leg was fine to be in there and then she got her claw stuck on the lining on the inside so she was actually walking around the house wearing one of my boots very weird situation. Thank you. Leech has just been disqualified. Two to go. Keep it together. Oh, you don't see that in second split very often. Seven point seven seconds. Push now. The guy behind is catching. Yeah, but of course, being a cat, she didn't want any help. Every time I got close to her, she walked backwards wearing my boots. Well, boot. Oh, I fucked that up. Okay, 
Police, hold your nerve, just keep it smooth. No mistakes. No mistakes, right. That's what I've been doing wrong. Eventually she sorted it out herself. Whoops, that was a mistake. Oh, he's got me. The pressure. Last lap, looking good for a podium. That was a 115, 1, 2, 2. Remember, the goal here is 2k, not podium. If we can get podium, that's nice. The there we go. Yeah, always the cat's fault. And there's the finish. Good result, mate. Well done. You're in the 2K now, aren't you? That, that, that should give you 2K, shouldn't it? Yep, yep. I'm. Uh... 2044. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I was exactly on 2000, exactly. <laughs> anyway, Mark, catch your legs on, mate. Until next time. Oh, no. Got two things going now. There we go. everyone 2000 i rating we're in the elite <laughs> thank you alan vip pass will be very much appreciated i'll get all the big sponsorships now have just walked in like what are you doing <laughs>